Sziasztok! Hi everyone! I'm Sándor, welcome to another Hungarian lesson. Let's talk about colors. We haven't talked about colors yet. First off, color in Hungarian is scene. Scene. Let's see how we call the scenes in Hungarian. Fekete. Black. Fekete. Fehér. White. Fehér. Zöld. Green. Zöld. Kék. Blue. Kék. Yellow is sárga. Sárga. But we also call it citrom sárga. Citrom sárga. Citrom means lemon. So literally it means lemon yellow. We usually just say sárga. But it's important to know citrom sárga as well because orange in Hungarian is narancs sárga. Narancs sárga. Narancs means orange. So in Hungarian we call this color orange yellow. And unlike with yellow, you cannot shorten this word. So it's always narancs sárga. Narancs sárga. Red is piros. Piros. But sometimes we call a certain shade of red vörös. Vörös. For example, red hair is vörös haj. Vörös haj. The fox's fur is also vörös. But if I'm being honest, I have no idea where something stops being piros and becomes vörös. Let's move on. Szürke. Gray. Szürke. Rózsaszín. Pink. Rózsaszín. Rózsaszín literally means rose color. Rózsa means rose. Barna. Brown. Barna. One other thing, if you want to say light green, for example, you have to put the word világos before the color that you're describing. And you have to write it as one word. So light green becomes világos zöld. Világos zöld. I think you already know that when an S and a Z is written together, it becomes an S sound. Not in this case, since this is a compound word, the two letters just happen to meet in the middle, but they keep their original form. I know that it's a bit hard to pronounce an S sound and a Z right after that. In everyday speech, the S sound becomes very soft in this case. There are quite a few instances where things like this happen, and I'll always try to address it, okay? Anyway, light blue is világos kék. Világos kék. Light brown is világos barna. Világos barna. And so on. If you want to say that a color is dark, you have to put the word sötét before the color and once again write it together. Dark green is sötét zöld. Sötét zöld. Dark blue is sötét kék. Sötét kék and so on. Well, I hope this lesson was useful to you. If you like this, please hit the like and subscribe, and see you all in the next lesson. Sziasztok! A viszontlátásra!